Hi guys, Tim from Halo ITSM and today we'll be running through suppliers in the system. Let's take a look. So when you look at the system, supplies is a whole module by itself. This allows you to identify your third parties in a single area and allow you to attribute them to different billing areas, to different tickets, and uh, it means that you're able to interact with these third parties in a systematic and auditable way. Jumping back to the system, one of the main ways you can link tickets to the suppliers is that when you come into the ticket, so let's grab any old ticket from here, there's a button up here called Log the Supplier. What this allows you to do is you're able to link an incoming issue, turn around, speak to your supplier on a separate conversation without each party seeing the remittances of each conversation. So for instance, you're able to turn around and use an email template and say, look supplier, here's some notes. I need X, Y, Z from you. Can you please get it? Can you please hurry and ensure this is delivered to us? Whether it's be a service or a product, you can track both. Um, and then for instance, you can then turn around and chat to your, uh, your end user, the one you're supporting, whether that be internally or externally from your business, and you can avoid the email chain including those updates from that, that supplier third party. You can also include supplier refs as well, and you also choose from here exactly what supplier there is that you're talking to. You can even link it to a contract also, as you can see from here. So if it is under a certain contract, this request is being made, you can do this in this box here, and this will be reportable also. Jumping back to the home screen, going into suppliers themselves, let's go to new so let's create a brand new supplier so in here you can enter all the information any sort of relevant contact information you want to share you can also go into the settings area as well and you'll be able to include the email start tag and the end tag so you can attribute this ticket so you can raise a ticket excluding the end user and it'll be raised as a separate ticket in the system that's what you're able to do here you can also in terms of billing in terms of sending out um, purchase orders or anything like that you'll be able to include this in here so you'll be able to create this as an entity inside your billing tool you can also show supplier as well SLAs so you can ensure that if you have a contract for level of service with your supplier this is replicated in the system also jumping back to the home screen that's all I wanted to share with you today feel free to check out other guys we have on Halo ITSM you can visit us at haloitsm.com